Now that we've done our color patterns and our number patterns, Alvin is ready to some bit to do some bigger number patterns. So what we've done here is we have a one, two, three, four. I wrote the first one down, and what he has to do is fill in the blanks. Alvin, can you look from here? We're gonna start here, and you count the cubes. Can you count the cubes? One, two, three. <gasps> There's something missing here. You have to fill in the blanks. Do you have something that's missing? Yeah. Oh, three. Three. Do you have three cubes the same color? Yeah. Oh, so put it in place. So we have one, two, three, four. Four. Then again. One. One. Two. Oh, what are we missing? Two. We're missing the two. One. Two. Two. Three. Four. Now what are we missing? Four. What comes after four? No, we're just doing up to five. One, two, two three, four. Two. One, two, three, four. 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 What's missing? Four. Look what's in your hand. What do you have in your hand? One. One. So we go back to one. After four comes one. Put one. the one down. One. One. And what comes after one? Two. Two. Three. Three. And we don't really have enough for four, but those are our number patterns. So as you can see, you can do lots of different combinations, and it gets more and more difficult. Good job, Alvin.